Hello, we are discussing about gate 2007 EC paper. Look at the RC circuit shown. Find which type of filter is this. So this will be consisting of R and C elements. And out of this one, filter is going to be treated as it is going uh, filter. The function of filter is to pass a certain frequencies and it has to block the remaining frequencies. Okay, low pass filter as the name says, which passes all low frequency signals up to a upper cutoff frequency FH. High pass filter which passes all high frequency signals starting from a lower cutoff frequency FL. Band pass filter which passes a band of frequencies. Okay, it doesn't pass low frequencies, it doesn't pass high frequencies. Band reject filter, it also called as band elimination filter or notch filter which eliminates a certain band of frequencies. It passes all frequencies except a band of frequencies. Okay, so now we are going to find which type of filter is this. So definitely filter should consisting of frequency sensitive elements. That means they must contain either L or C or both. Now this circuit consisting of C that is a capacitor. Capacitor is a frequency sensitive element we know the reactance of capacitor xc is equal to 1 by 2 pi fc so for dc signals how it will be behaving for ac signals how it will behave that we will see okay for dc and low frequency signals for dc and low frequency signals that is 5 hertz 10 hertz 15 hertz like this for small frequency signals are dc signal DC means F is equal to 0. Frequency is 0 for DC. Low frequency signals is very small frequencies like 5 edges, 2 edges, 10 edges, 15 edges in that range. So by that time XC is very very large such that it is approximately equal to infinite. So it is acting as capacitor act as open circuit. And for very high frequencies for very high frequencies very high frequencies that means f is very very large for f is very very large x is very very small so it will be approximated as zero by that time it act as short circuit so capacitor act as open circuit for low frequency signals as well as for dc signal and capacitor act as short circuit for high frequency signals so in between this low frequency and high frequency, the capacitor exists and its effect will be present on the circuit given. So according to this condition, you can say the answer as, okay, so replace the, that is write the equivalent circuit at low frequencies, that is at zero and low frequencies and replace uh, write the circuit at very high frequencies from that one we will see what happens okay so first case one at dc and low frequencies equivalent circuit is capacitor is acting as open circuit capacitor act as open circuit so whenever capacitor act as open circuit the resistance is present but the capacitance will not present so resistance is present and capacitor act as open circuit this is equivalent circuit. Now, since it is open circuit, okay, so no current flows from this point. So I is equal to 0, V naught is equal to 0. V naught is equal to 0 even V input is applied, even VI applied because capacitor is acting as open circuit. So that means input is applying but you are not getting output. That is no transmission is taking place from the input to output. Okay. So zero frequencies and low frequencies are not passed. That is blocked. Okay. And second case. Second case is at very high frequencies. At very high frequencies capacitor is acting as short circuit. When capacitor is acting as short circuit, then the equivalent circuit is capacitor uh, resistor followed by a short circuit and resistor followed by a short circuit. 
this is v naught and it is vi now also v input is applying but current flows current flows whenever current is flows we expect output v naught but as the capacitor is getting short circuited this point and this point are shorted this resistance doesn't have any effect so that entire current is going through this short circuit only so v naught will be equal to zero even though input is applied but now it is because of short circuiting of capacitor effect so again we are going to say in the same thing v naught is equal to zero even v i applied that is even though the input signal is applied you are not getting any output that is no transmission is taking place so high frequency signals of input are blocked okay and third case is admit frequencies third case is at mid frequencies at mid frequencies is nothing but in between the case 1 and case 2 it is not low frequency it is not very high frequency by that time capacitor cannot act as either open circuit or short circuit simply it will exist so the circuit is going to be same circuit you are going with then v naught you are going to get v naught as a part of as a function of input signal you will get v naught as v naught is equal to r parallel c divided by r parallel c plus r plus 1 by sc r parallel 1 by sc sorry r parallel 1 by sc plus r plus 1 by sc in this way you are going to get a port part of inputs so input signal is passed to outputs with this ratio so it is not passing the low frequency signal it is not passing the high frequency signal it is passing only a range of frequencies in the middle that means it is acting as a band pass filter band pass filter will pass a band of frequencies so it is not passing low it is not passing high frequencies it is passing a frequencies in the middle so the right option for this question is c otherwise method 2 also there we can also calculate in the other way so now we will see method 2 second method <coughs> first method is this way second method i will assume that one this circuit is divided into two blocks this is first block and it is second block okay so this is a cascading of two circuits the given circuit is consisting of two networks one is network 1 the other is network 2 okay cascading of network 1 and cascading of network 2 and in between there is a voltage which we are assuming that one vx so vx is the voltage present between these two networks by that time you can say vx is output of network 1 when vi is input and vi consisting of 0 to you can apply any frequency from 0 to infinity frequency of input signal can be any value from 0 to infinity and vx we are saying it as output of network 1 when input signal is consisting of vi and if you observe this is going to be acting as high pass filter the network 1 is acting as high pass filter because capacitor is in series with vi okay you can check the high pass filter simple high pass filter circuit is this one where resistance is nothing but output okay so input is input and output is separated by a capacitor which blocks the dc and low frequency signal so it is called as high pass filter so vx will be consisting of only high frequency signals okay output of high pass filter which consisting of frequencies from fl to infinity all the frequencies all high frequency signals starting from a lower cut off frequency that means fl okay and next v naught can be written as output of network 2 when input is vx and vx is when input is vx 
and Vx will be consisting of only Fl to infinity only. And if you observe this network 2, network 2 now it is acting as low pass filter. So you can expect that one you can recollect. So low pass filter is having a nature of this one. Okay, V0 Vi. So output will be acting as a low pass filter if you take the voltage across capacitor for a RC combination. So now it is capacitor is in parallel with output so it is acting as a low pass filter. So now V0 is simply output of low pass filter. Low pass filter passes all low frequencies from 0 to FH. Okay, 0 to FH but it is neglecting the values frequencies already this high pass filter is blocking from 0 to FL. So out of this 0 to FH you can say it as 0 to FL and FL to FH. Okay. Now the frequencies are 0 to FL and FL to FH. So these frequencies are already blocked. So what is the remaining frequencies is FL to FH. This range of frequencies is now output will be consisting of the range of frequencies range of frequencies is FL minus FH. That means it is acting as bandpass filter. Okay. So a series combination of high pass filter or low pass filter. Okay. And a series combination of low pass filter followed by high pass filter will always work as bandpass filter will always work as bandpass filter only the condition is okay <coughs> only the condition is FL should be lesser than FH if this condition satisfies a cascading of high pass and low pass filters in either way that act as bandpass filter now the circuit is bandpass filter so the right option for this question is C